Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, my name is Erin and I am a mom of five and a reseller on Poshmark and eBay. And today I wanted to share with you all a thrift haul of what I found this weekend. So I only had time to go into one Goodwill this weekend. Um, so I did not find as much as I have um, the past several weeks, but I did find some great items. So I wanted to share them all with you. So I did find two pairs of shoes this time. I will show you all those first. The first pair of shoes was the Sam Edelman little wedge sandals. I have sold these in the past and they did sell pretty quickly. Um, these are the Romy sandals. So nice thing about Sam Edelman is they usually have right in there, the size and the style name. So it makes it very easy to find what you are selling. Um, but these were in great condition. And I know summer is um, ending here pretty soon, but I figured Sam Edelman is always a great brand. And with them being in pretty great condition, I didn't want to leave them behind. Then the other pair of shoes I got were these Lucky Brand. And these also were in great condition. Um, the lucky brand in there. And these also have the style name on the inside along with the size. Um, so that makes it easy to find. So um, with boot season approaching, I thought these would do great. So I got those. Now for my clothes items. This was a pretty exciting find. It was, or is, <laughs> Max Mara, and it is new with tags. So this has Canadian pricing. It says $820. So I'm, I have to look up how that converts to US money, but I know it's still a pretty good amount of money. So it is this, it's like a faux wrap front dress like animal print um, and I just thought it was so pretty and new with tags. Of course, I'm going to pick it up. So my plan with this dress is to send it in to the Real Real. I have never sold on there before, um, but I am wanting to try it out. And I have um, probably three other items that I want to send in with this that I found in the past few weeks. So I will keep you all posted on how this does, but I'm hoping to get a good amount for it. So we will see. The next item that I found were these frame jeans and they are Lahai Skinny, size 30. So these I can tell run small. Um, these don't look like a size 30 to me, um, but I did list that in the description that they seem to run small. Uh, but they have the raw hem a little side slit, which is cute. And these are in great condition. So I got those. Then I found a pair of Lululemon, like cropped pants, and it has the logo on the back there. So these, I cannot find a size. Um, I looked in, it has like a back zipper pocket. I looked in the pocket and it has little side pockets. Um, but there's the size tags removed and I could not find a size dot. So I am going to have to find these, what these are and compare it to other, um, listings if they show their measurements to see what I think these are. And then I'll just list the measurements in the description and someone can see if they think they'd fit. But, um, these were in great condition, real comfy and soft. So I got those. This was another exciting find, Tory Burch, and it is a sweater, cream sweater, and it has all these little open knit on it, little open knit panels. Um, so I already have this listed. I listed it for $50, um, so we'll see how it does, but it was just in great condition and really cute, a great uh, transition piece for fall since it's kind of like an open, a little bit cooler of a sweater. This was a new to me brand. It is called Honey Bum. 
and it is a teddy bear jacket. So I know these were really popular last year, so I'm still hoping that they'll be popular this year. Um, this is not anything that'll sell for a lot. I think I have it listed for uh, $30 in my closet. So I'd be happy with $25. Um, but I think it's something that's trendy and maybe bring some traffic to my store. So if it doesn't sell, I will gladly keep this because it is cozy for fall and winter. The next item that I found was the North Face, like a fluffy vest. And this was neat. Um, it is reversible. So it has like this fuzzy outside and then you can flip it and wear that part on the inside. And then this, this is, you can wear it like this. So, and it has little pockets on both sides. So I thought this was something just different. I had never seen anything like this. Um, so I think it'll do well, and I'm not sure what I'm going to list it for yet. I still need to look up comps on it, but I think it will definitely sell. And this is a brand that is always so fun to find because um, they usually sell pretty quickly. It's Barefoot Dreams, and it is like a wine red color. So I have found um, these wraps maybe three or four before um, and they've always been the more neutral colors um, like tan and black and gray and those have always sold really fast um, for maybe $50 about maybe 40 to $60 somewhere around there um, so I'm interested to see how this does with it being a red um, but if it doesn't sell in fall I definitely think it will sell closer to Christmas um, but it was just in great condition, so cozy and soft. And it says it's a large, extra large, but um, I did list that it looks closer to a medium or large because the sleeves are a little bit more narrow. But these are so cozy. If you've never had one, I would definitely recommend getting one. I think I have three of them. <laughs> and I wear them a lot when the weather cools down. Then I found... This Gal Meets Glam dress. This was so pretty. It has these little pearl on the neckline and on the sleeves. And just the rest is just the solid black um, dress. But I have been finding this a few times within the past couple months and they have sold pretty quickly. So I was definitely excited to find another one. And this was a size 12. So um, I think that size will do great also. And then the last item that I found was Maeve by Anthropology, And it is just an off the shoulder dress. Um, and it has pockets and it's a midi length. And then in the back, it has kind of like a little cross opening in the back. So I just thought this was really pretty. I looked up comps on it and it was selling um, for pretty well maybe around the $40 price point so I would be very happy if I got that for it so that is everything that I found this past weekend um, so I'm definitely going to get all of this listed this week and then I do still have some stuff a lot of shoes that I've accumulated over the past couple months really um, that I need to list so since I don't have as many clothing items this week I'm really gonna work on getting all of my shoes listed and um, carry, have that carry me over to Friday when I can go thrifting again. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you enjoy thrift hauls, please consider subscribing to my channel and let me know if you found anything exciting this week also. So hope you all have a great week and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.